You just hit me with your car, sir. I gotta be a son of a. Yeah, you hit me. You hit my car. You hit me with that. I promise you. I gotta be a son of a. What's up, everybody? Welcome to the uh, Charleston Car Videos YouTube channel. So today we're gonna be looking at another rude car salesman. That's right. You know, take a minute to watch this video. You're gonna see, you know, a lot of news reports on it down in Sarasota, Florida. But I'm gonna do a little different twist on it because I know how a car salesman can be. And this guy was straight up aggravating this man, got him extremely upset. I mean, again, the man is 83 years old. I don't say that, um, that he had any right to go back in his trunk back here and get a golf club and hit the man's camera with it or hit him in the face, however that worked out. But at the same time, watch this clip coming up next and you'll see what I'm talking about. We're gonna do a little slow motion here of the actual um, hit with the golf club. Oh my God, you hit me with that As you saw there, man, Mr. Lindsay came up and really hit that guy pretty hard with the golf club or hit the camera. But anyways, poor Lindsay in jail for a night, aggravated battery arrest. Man, Mr. Lindsay, chill out. Don't get so mad. You know, old people at 83, sometimes you got to watch out for some of them because they will literally get out of hand quickly because they think that, hey, I'm old age. Nobody's going to necessarily fuck with me. So uh, that's what he did. But anyways, I don't give the salesman any right to sit there and act like a jerk. You know, you're going to see in a second here on this next part of the video. I mean, Basically, what I'm telling you is this car dealership, and they do this all the time, especially down in Florida, because I lived in Jacksonville for a short period of time. The car dealers down there, they hold events at malls and different big parking lots and stuff like that. They send out these 30 to 50,000 mailers, you know, scratch this off, win this, get you to the tent sale, right? And that's what this Nissan dealership has done. They sell a lot of cars at this stuff, but obviously this man thought he had won something and uh, when he got there, the sales guy said, well, you can't get your prize unless you buy a car. Now, as you can see, Mr. Lindsay drives a really pretty, looks like a 2016 Honda Accord EXL. What does he need with a brand new Nissan? Okay, he's coming up there. He's like, man, I won something. Let me uh, redeem my prize, right? They could have given the man a fucking t-shirt or a keychain and had, let him go on his day, you know? But anyways, they're gonna sit here at the window, screw with the man, talk shit to him. Instead of just walking away like a real man should do and leave the old guy alone, they didn't. The sales guy here with the camera is blowing kisses at him and um, and he's really sitting here just kind of aggravating this old man to the point where um, it just it, it, it escalates to where it doesn't need to go. So anyways, again, once again, another rude salesman. These are the kind of salespeople you just don't want to deal with when buying cars, okay? Again, you just don't want to deal with them. You don't want to deal with these types of salespeople, okay? That's not being professional in any manner. And I don't give that Nissan dealership any uh, any uh, props at all for doing these stupid ass uh, tent sales, okay? This stuff is a gimmick, it's a joke. If you get this stuff in the mail, again, it's just to draw you into the dealership. If you really want to buy a car and get a good deal, you know, like, look at my YouTube channel, for instance, okay? We're doing videos of the cars. We're talking about the prices on the videos. We're being transparent. These tent sales, again, is just a fucking scam, a sham, okay? It's just a big joke. And in Florida, they do a bunch of them. Mm-hmm. Now I'm going to call 911. Don't ever, don't ever do that. You just hit my phone. He hit him. He hit him. I got the yeah. tag number already. I got the tag number. He hit him. Assault. You're the stupidest bunch of you're going to be, down, hey, you're gonna be downtown with the boys tonight. I won't be I downtown like, anymore, Jack. I am the boys. I hope you like the boys. I am the boys. I hope you like the boys. Hey, 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 hey. No, he hit him. Sir, I don't know what. Sir, get your car and leave. What? Sir, get your car and leave. What the well, you got a bunch of nuts here, Jack. I, I, and I understand that, sir. Like you, you, knocked my, you knocked my phone out of my hand. You're lucky the screen didn't no, break or I would be calling the cops. You, you broke my mirror, Jack. Uh, you hit my arm you with it, sir. Huh? You hit him. You hit Be me with line, it. Son of a oh, you, we all saw it. Yep. Oh, come on. You hit him. Would, would you, sir, I, I'm being nice and not putting you in jail. 
Listen, I am the jail. I, I'm going to report you guys to Nissan tomorrow. Okay. Please do. We're going to report you to the sheriff tonight. I don't care what you do, Jack. You can bond okay, out. Bye. You got money to bond out. Bye. Get out of my face, you son of a I tell you, I don't know what you're saying. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Man, hit my phone and knocked it out of there, hit me with his car. I'll hit you. Go right ahead, I'll sue you. Please do. You hit me with that, you will be in jail. Nobody's giving you I've got you on camera, sir. You're having a bad hair day. I'm not having a bad day, but I'm going to get it. But you got a bunch of them. How, okay, how do you keep your money? Dude, I might as well sue you. Are you the manager? No, I need you to leave, sir. Are you the manager? No, sir, I need you to leave that. I'll leave when I want you. I need you to leave. Thank you, sir. Get my car again. I'll wheel run over. Grow up, sir. Hold on a second. So, as you just saw, uh, grow up, sir. I get it. I get being upset, getting upset and mad and saying a few words here and there. But look, think about it, folks. Y'all just seen the actual raw video that this guy right here took off of his phone that night. You can uh, you can hear his voice. He's kind of picking with the old man, giving him, you know, just the old cup of roo, whatever you want to call it. Anyways, he's really screwing with the guy and upsetting him. And, uh, you know, certain people you just can't screw with, man. I mean, they're really going to do that stuff. But anyways, you know, I mean, the guy's saying here on this video with the news report that, you know, he's at home, he's resting up, he got hit in the face pretty hard with a golf club, and um, luckily that foam was up near his face, so it maybe has shielded some of the hit. But um, anyways, the news really ate this story up, and I'm going to report on it because, again, I think... Overall, these tent sales are not cool, and I'm actually happy to see that someone got extremely angry about the whole situation because, you know, again, I work in the automotive industry myself, and uh, and I don't like seeing customers get upset like that, and especially with a, uh, with a guy behind a camera sitting there screwing with them. You know, I mean, I get it. Pick up the phone, the camera, start recording. That's really about your best way to protect yourself in these types of situations, but... Um, at the same time, don't keep egging people on like that. Let the old man roll the hell out and get on his way, you know. But uh, this escalated to putting the old man in, in, in jail. So, uh, again, the old man should not have hit this guy right here with the golf club. That was the first thing where he screwed up. And uh, the car dealership, I'm curious what they had to say about it, you know. I mean, we're not seeing that side of the story. Anyways, how many other people uh, probably got upset and had to go home and didn't get that prize that they su supposedly say you're going to win when you go in? Anyways, you know, now that this kind of uh, happened, next time I get one of those mailers from a uh, car dealership in town at my house, I'm going to scratch off. I'm going to grab that key on the, on the envelope, and I'm going to head down to the dealership, and I'm going to make me a little video. So stay tuned. <laughs>